Am I alive again? I am not sure. I'm trying to both play and try to fix this. I don't want my timer to run out. for a minute. Oh. oh god, chat doesn't seem to be working either. I just typed in a message and it did not work. Okay, looks like maybe Chad is back. Yeah, actually, I don't think that that was me. I think it may have been Twitch. Because it said it lost connection to the server. So I'm not sure. Maybe they have a settle or something, but nope, they didn't. This is so weird. Like on, on my on my channel, like none of my stuff is loaded. It's just Oh, that's interesting. So the I'm gonna actually refresh the page again because I, I can see my thing that says testing. You guys are talking in the, um, in the, uh, I can see it in the Twitch bot, like on my exploit, but not on the actual page itself. So that's pretty funny. So I'm just catching up here. So pointing at the commander, you're, there's a roadblock. <laughs> Two mana, 12 toss is a decent rate. Thank you. Thank you. You're still alive. Still alive. Okay. Yes. Okay. My Twitch page looks a lot better now. I'm going to assume that it is going to work now. But I'll also try to keep an eye on my exploit one, just in case. Yeah, but now it's showing like the bits and everything too, so. I think it's fast ready. And that makes me think even more that Twitch just had a little blippy. Ooh. Um, you know what? It's doable. We have a dinosaur that we can reveal and get a planes. And then we just have to get into another land and yeah, I'd be able to do it. 
It's not a great hand, but I think we can make it work. They mold. There we go. You have cards that stay in binders for good reasons. Drop out of the stampede. And then Ancient Brontodon will only be six instead of eight. You have Skittles the Dragon and rarely sees play. I'm not sure who that is. going to be able to play this next turn. This is hilarious. Oh, okay. I guess they're Esper City's Blessing? That's all from this. <laughs> A happy little 9-9. Nine -nine. So. Ah, Skithrix. Gotcha. That's the infect one. Yeah. Okay, I know what that one is. I mean, that's pretty good. Now, if I can just stay wide enough, they don't have another flyer. I can just kill their flyer and then kill them. Stasis, only for emergency use. <laughs> Stasis, everybody stop, just stop. Ancient Brontodon actually came in handy. I was a little unsure about that pick. But it worked out! <laughs> Opponent Dobbs. Hey, we're, we have a better record now than we did before. Thank you. Sometimes you just need a 9 9, right? Can't tap down all permanence in response. That's where you get a sleep or a tempest collar or something. Do do like uh, have Teferi out, you know the the creature, and then uh, flash out Tempest Caller and tap down all the creatures. That's that's the play, right? Mm. 
I mean, maybe. I haven't really been striving for rank at all. But I'm still fairly convinced it means nothing. Do they reveal gold such at them? I don't think they have this. Well, they actually could. They are in black. But I don't think they have this card, so I'm just going to reveal it. Game of life. And we will get another forest. You were taught commander the old school way, hardcore no mercy. Aww. That's all right. We gained a little life from him. Will I still be able to cast it? I actually don't think I will. So I'm sure all time. Flying Galta is a circus act you would pay to see. Well, let's see if it's gonna get effed up. Drop a nine nine. In case they've got any, you know, removal. Yep, that is a uh, Galton keeps sneaking his way into my hand. It's pretty nice. That's five. Still alive. I deem this an acceptable offering. Yeah, it's true. I'm going to play HQ words because I missed regular HQ and I want to try to earn my extra lives. fan of the storm mechanic. <laughs> I could uh, exile that and <laughs> get a 3-3, three, three, but I don't think it's a bother.
Oh, it's literally just a one-two flyer? <laughs> okay. Also cheaper, no attacks. I'm going to do Bronte first. pieces because no one wants the Crow Storm. out to you, why not? Card was used when force of will was in standard. <laughs> Them. I need 23 playables when I always draw Galta, right? And I keep getting Priest Awakening Sun, which can get me Galta as well. Okay, well, last game no matter what. Let's let's see if we can do seven. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you found it. Wait, no. <laughs> no, that's that's tomorrow night. Tomorrow night we we start a uh, uh, what's it called zero time dilemma, the third game in the series. I, I literally typed it, but one of the letters was missed. Whatever. Whatever, HQ words. <laughs> this is why everyone hates you. Um. You know, Stampede again. You know, won't watch if there isn't a bikini clad secret agent on it. Well. I don't know about a secret agent. But there has been a bikini clad woman in the first two games. I would be extremely shocked if there wasn't one in this game. That seems to be a recurring theme. Uh, okay, we'll do this. And this.
Nobody will like, is, is Eric the Dio of this game? Sooner or later, everybody's got to put up with Theo. <laughs> Aww. All right. Well, there's always got to be one, right? In 999, we were lucky. He died real early. Eric might be even more annoying than Dio? No. How is that possible? want to watch letters narrate bad Japanese plot points. Yes. That is, I mean, that's, that's the joy. That's the joy. I really, I've always very much liked reading out loud, and so the, the visual novel seems to be just a really good thing for me to stream, because I like reading out loud. gonna need to have like an actual creature soon guys <laughs> do, do we think we can manage that um i'm gonna keep being aggro to at least get their life total down and their and or their creature total down Doki Doki Literature Club. I have been told to steer clear of that game because I do not like horror. Not looking too good at the moment. That's why you play Japanese games, no lore. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna take the 13. I'm okay. I can go to eight. Whatever, dude. Look, see? I like my impressive super land. Now it's a 3-3. Three, three. Mmm. No attacks. We're gonna die. Yep. It's alright. Six and three isn't bad. And it's one of those things where it's like, there was literally nothing I could do. I, I just got mana flooded. Maybe I could have not been so aggro and kept my people longer, but... 
Yeah. And at this point, like, even a son of a wreckage wouldn't save us. Yeah. I drew so many lands toward the end. Yeah, I don't think so either. Yeah, it's it's just I'm I'm just gonna. They're taking a little bit, so I'm just going to go ahead. I have one more game's last four midnight releases, really? Well, thank you. I will claim the prize. We, uh, we got more gems than we spent, so we'll take it, huh? For the packs. say that that is a treasure map because I still haven't gotten one. Um, we're going to say not collected. Treasure map. And I really want one. So. Okay, but I also did get the one dude, the, he was, yeah, Ruthless Knave. He could be semi-helpful as well. Um, and then there was one more dude who's, who's not collected. Uh, what was the, Pitiless Plunderer? Yeah, Pitiless Plunderer. He would be pretty helpful. Put him into the rotation as well. And uh, we'll just have fewer of other things. Um, I feel like the, uh, the what's a face never works out. The, um, how many nights do I have? I'll try going back down to, uh, I'll try going back down to 24 lands and see if that helps. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, the whole, th and that's my thing too, is it's like, I, I don't, I don't want to play, you know, what's, what's the top deck right now, out right now, I don't know, Boros, I don't want to play the same Boros deck over and over against the same other Boros decks. <laughs> like, I want to be creative and win in fun and interesting ways and like it, that's that's it's it's not as important winning is not as important as having fun i think especially when it's not like so much of any money in the line you know hmm <laughs> Hi, Sixteen Bitch and Obi. How you doing today? Just put out Sailor Moons. He can block. If he doesn't immediately die. Bare minimum, he, he gives us a treasure. Not want to play Tefri and win an infinitely boring 80 turn mill game? No. No, I don't.
Mm. Oh, just you. Um, let us control temptation for the beginning of us anyway. soon. Can I put out two creatures? I think I can now, because I just top decked into one, but I mean, they also have to, like, not murder them. So, yeah. Oh, Lord. And then if I block that, then it's three. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> and they're gonna destroy my things anyway. Yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I, I don't like the tech rewind condition. What I especially dislike is the Nexus non-win condition, where the people just move forever. Okay. Yeah, he's a really good draw engine for sure. And he can also remove threats. Yeah, for sure. I like the card, just not the way he is used in standards, right? Yeah, totally. Nobody wants to play those games out. The brazen freebooter. back into your hand next turn. Just in case they have any like sudden oh things are hard to do or something. They're tapped out now so I'll do it now. Um, we'll pass. Yeah, can you go open up the billion turn move? Oh no. 
It needs spells. And I will attack. Bears get last and only build for a pro play. I suppose. Right away, Mountain? Get him out. That's a little better. We need to have to block it. They gonna do it again? Three color infect for modern years ago that worked well. Hmm. Um, I have a Naya infect deck. It's pretty nifty. Um, so the way it works is uh, it has um, what's his name? Sidar Kondo or something like that. He's a green white guy partner commander and um. Um, and he says that creatures with power two or less can't be blocked except by creatures with reach or flying. At least ones that are like other than what you control. Um, so it makes it so that uh, like if you have little one one infect guys, they can swing through and people can't block them unless they have reach or flying creatures. So it works out pretty nicely. Ooh, Galta. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Well. Um, I think I'm going to sack a treasure to draw a card because hot dang. Worth it. Double worth it. Um, okay. Yeah, it's not. Definitely. Um. Assuming, you know, it doesn't die or whatever. I can ritual of soot and then get there.
that's okay, as long as you can't make it bigger. One life, one life, upkeep! <laughs> you lose! I am rich, life does not matter! Oh, oh, that was lovely, that was lovely. Oh. We'll, we'll do one more. That was amazing. It could be a good spot to end, but we'll do one more. That's fine. <laughs> Thank you. That's the point of this deck, is to win with that condition. I can win through combat as well, but it's rare. Dead Eye Plunderers is the main guy that helps that. You approve. <laughs> um, I, I went uh, six and three in the second one. My first one didn't go as well. That one, I think I did two and three. Six and three. Uh, six wins, three losses. Thank you. Yeah, I got Galta as, as the first pick, so, you know, that helps. Like, I'm just gonna keep gasping it. Sure, get some draw, why not? Uh, Dead Eye Plunderers. Because it's big. And then we'll pass. Well, it does seem to get the message that I would rather not have that on the board, right? Oh, excellent fighting! No! Um... I'd rather not have it under Ixlong's binding. So I will stack it. I get the same amount of treasure back, so. Prosperous pirate seems like a good idea. <laughs> oh no! Oh, that might 
kill me. That may very well kill me. Nope. <laughs> I was like, maybe I'll get some bounce? bad spot. If we top deck uh, um, the board wipe, that would work out pretty well, but we don't. Um, we get another land. starting a new game, Zero Time Dilemma, um, and uh, yeah, then, then I will be back on Saturday at 2 um, in the afternoon, Eastern Time, to play some Magic, and that should be after all the new cards and stuff are in, so hopefully we'll be doing some of that stuff. So until then, have a good night everybody. Stay safe.